For more videos visit forthesakeofeducation.com Alright guys, now we're gonna do this problem that says express the force as a Cartesian vector. So basically you have a force acting from A to B. So to find this force and its Cartesian vector form, first we're gonna need to work with a vector A to B. So first you wanna find the position vector of all the points involved. Now A, as you can see, sits at 2i plus 0j plus 2k because it sits on the x and c plane. Now position vector v sits at 4i plus 3j minus 4k. Now vector a to b is calculated by subtracting vector a from vector b. So 4 minus 2 is 2i, 3 minus 0 is 3j, minus 4 minus 2 is minus 6k. Now you want to find the magnitude of this vector and you're going to get this by doing the x squared plus y squared plus c squared. So when you plug in these three values into this formula, you're going to get that the magnitude is 7, exactly 7. Now that you have the magnitude, you can find the univector AV. The univector AV is a tiny vector with a magnitude of 1 aiming in the direction as vector AB and also aiming in the direction as the force. So the univector AB is found by dividing the vector by its magnitude. So you're going to divide each of these values by 7 and you're going to get the univector which is 0.286i plus 0.429j minus 0.857k. Now that you have this univector and you know that the magnitude of the force is 630 newtons, to find the Cartesian vector form of the force, all you gotta do is multiply the magnitude by a univector aiming in its direction. So multiplying each of these three values by this magnitude is gonna give you the Cartesian vector form of the force, which comes out to be 180i plus 270j minus 540k final answer please comment below if you want me to do any problems and i'll be happy to help thank you